Hi everyone and welcome to the video. It's going to be quite a simple video today. I'm just going to show you how to add a new page to your WordPress website and at the moment in my example I'm just using a fresh install on a Fasthost, web, uh, Fasthost WordPress hosting package. So this is my website here. Um, it's literally just a home page with a hello world on which is how you'll see it on a normal installation. Um, so from the dashboard I'm logged into the WordPress dashboard here. You go ahead and go to pages and here we're going to see the about page, which is there by default. Uh, so we're not going to really do it, worry about that for too much. What you will notice quickly here is that that about page isn't actually accessible from my website at the moment. And the reason for that is there's a setting in WordPress that's got my posts as my home page. So that hello world post that you're seeing there is actually there. I will come on to how to change that. But first, I'm going to show you how to actually add a page. So we can go back to pages, go to add new. And I'm not going to go into too much depth about how to actually make a page because there's a lot of options and that in itself will be its whole own video. But we will add a title so we can recognize it later on. And then to add a bit of content, add here you add things called blocks on the uh, wordpress editor at the moment so i'm just going to add a quick paragraph okay so we've got our new page i can post this now um to make it live i will just show you a couple of the more hidden options um if you're comfortable with coding you might want to look at uh, the editor itself rather than using these uh, website building sort of blocks if you like and that was over here and if you click that you can do code editor and that's one of the more common things that people can't find so it's worth just showing and there you can sort of do html and put any code in that you like but we'll just go back to the visual editor and like I say, there's a lot of options in here. Uh, that in itself, I think, is, is, is too much for this little video. Uh, so I'm not going to go through too much more here. But I am going to publish. Am I ready to publish? And you can change your visibility. So if you want to just pre preview it, you can make it private. And you'll only see it on your main website if you're logged in. But I'm going to make it public for now. So that's published. And if we click the view page link, that's what it looks like online. But if we go back to, to my main website, so this is my home page. If I refresh this, still no record of that page. So I'm just going to quickly show you how to change the settings there. If you already know how to do that, you can go ahead and close the video. But if you're not sure, I'll just uh, quickly show you. So at the moment, my posts are what's showing on my home page. And we don't necessarily want that. So under settings, you can go to reading. And it will be your home page displays your latest posts and we want it to change to a static page. So let's make it Will's new page. And we want our post page to be, uh, we actually wanted it to be blog. But if I wanted to do that, I'd make a blank page called blog. And then I just select what my, where my post page went. So now if we go back to our main website and refresh. We can see that we've got my new page being displayed there. So that's exactly what we're after. And I think I'll leave the video there. And um, we have got more videos and more guides on how to do some more sort of in-depth stuff. And there's plenty on the WordPress support site as well, which is a really useful tool as well, um, just because it's the most up to date. And that's all for now. Thanks very much for watching. Goodbye.